Hi, I'm Lynn Rose, and welcome to Access to Experts TV. So have you ever watched TV and said to yourself, mm. I could have done that? Have you ever <laughs> secretly thought about a career in show business? Secretly? Mm. Well, then you want to talk to my next guest, Maura Soden. She has been in show business for 30 years. She is still a working actress. She has cast over 275 commercials and has produced and written for some of your favorite film and television shows. So if you want the full 360 degree perspective on how to start your career in show business, stay put. <laughs> Welcome, Laura. Oh, thank you, Lynn. A lovely introduction. Oh, thank you. Well, I, I got to learn from the best. <laughs> so, speaking of which, what is the best advice that you can give to someone who has always wanted to come to Hollywood? Find another career. <laughs> right. You know, it, it, you know, it is a hard career. Uh, let's face it. There yep. are many, many people out here trying to make it. But I really believe that passion and tenacity can carry you very far. And mm. if you stay the course and you do have some talent, you, you can make it. You can make a decent living here. So just don't give up. But you should come prepared with a few little uh, skills in your bag. Oh, really? And so yes. what is in that bag of skills, mm. Nora? Well, I would say the first thing is to have a flexible job. So you can go out to auditions, not have to worry. Um, and, and nowadays it's so much easier because you don't just have to be a waiter. There are online businesses, there are virtual businesses. So you, you don't have to have that desperate quality when we go to <laughs> audition going, oh, if I don't get this, I can't pay my rent. Um, you, you don't want to have that. You want to go in with confidence and, and know the rent is paid. Yeah, you don't want to be out there in this career and repelling everybody you see. Exactly. Right? And, and I have seen that in a few <laughs> casting offices. I so, bet. yeah. So once you got that down, then yeah. what's next? The main thing is the headshot that is truly your calling card mm -hmm. and every day thousands of pictures come across a casting director's desk and yours needs to pop out and it will pop out if it's a good clean shot it looks like you there's something going on in the eyes <laughs> um, then maybe you know you'll, you'll have a shot of being called in just to, for the audition but the headshot's the key so you have to get it done by a professional photographer not at a birthday party and somebody <laughs> cuts your little face out do yeah. the real deal so using my iphone just it won't cut it well you know <laughs> Lynn, I, I don't want to tell you what to do, but yeah. uh, we can help you. That's good. Mm -hmm. and, and you know what, you look out there now and it seems like there's so much diversity on TV. Yes. I mean, does that mean that there's more opportunities than ever for aspiring actors? Absolutely. There used to be just three networks. Now we have hundreds of cable stations out there to choose from. There are webcasts. There are people making their own movies, little <laughs> indies, that are getting a lot of notice. So there's that, um, and as well as comedy clubs. A lot of people don't think about that. They're funny, and you're like, get on stage. Who knows who's going to find you? That's how Ray Romano was found, and George Lopez. Oh, so, yeah. oh, and let's not forget YouTube. <laughs> I mean, who would know about Justin Bieber if it wasn't for that? Exactly. Although I bet you there's a lot of people that are thinking, I've got to be Justin Bieber's age to even try to think about coming to Tinseltown. I mean, is there a perfect age to come there? Absolutely not. You can come right out of the womb and you're doing a diaper commercial. And for the over 60s, there are plenty of pharmaceutical <laughs> ads to be had. So truly, there is no retirement age. And, and the best example of that is Betty White. Right, right. Mm -hmm. Love that. Well, mm -hmm. so now it's a really big town. Yeah. Where do you begin? How do you begin? It is daunting when you first get here and you know no one. So I always recommend just go to the extras agencies and start getting out on those sets. At least you're doing something within the industry you want to be in. You don't know who you could meet. Anywhere from the director, the AD, uh, to a myriad of other actors who all have information that would be good for you to learn. You know, when you're just off the, the, the bus, so to speak, you've got to catch up on who are the best acting coaches, mm -hmm. who are the best photographers, who, you know, all of those things, the, those actors could share with you. And plus, they're also friends after you're right. spending a whole day with them on right. the set or a week sometimes. But we know that there's a wealth of knowledge that you have, even a lot of that advice. Mm -hmm. And in fact, you even give acting seminars around the country. Yes, we do. But if someone's not in a place where you're giving an acting seminar, but they want some of your, your wealth of wisdom, is there, what way can someone get more tips from you on oh. making it in Hollywood? No problem. Uh, acting up. <laughs> TV is my website and on there I have all kinds of other tips and, and really if, if you pay attention to them 
I think you're going to learn a lot, and it'll it'll make your way a lot more easy coming out here. Because you know, when I came out, I, there wasn't any of this available. And you make mistakes, and you're taken advantage of by, you know, these charlatans in the business. But I hope to change all that for for the next group coming out. Oh yes, I mean, where were you at the start of my career? <laughs> I needed you more. Probably <laughs> sitting on the bus next to you. That's right, exactly. That's right. <laughs> so, so acting up. Dot TV, acting up dot TV, get these free tips mm. and maybe we'll see you in Hollywood. Yes. It was so fun acting up with you, Maura. Oh, you too. Thank, Thank you. you so much. Thank Wonderful. You. So stay tuned for next time on Access to Experts TV.